Hi, I'm Kim Haynes, Preschool Resource Specialist for Madison County Schools. I want to take just a few minutes to share some important information with you about Alabama's nationally recognized first class pre-K. In Madison County Schools, we offer two types of preschool, developmental pre-K and first class pre-K, also called OSR. Developmental pre-K is offered through our special education department and primarily serves children with a variety of unique needs. If you have questions about this program, please contact the special education department. First class pre-K is the program that I primarily work with. There are first class pre-K classrooms in public schools, private schools, daycares, military bases, churches, YMCA, and the like. To be eligible, families must complete an online application at the web address seen here, as well as bringing a few documents to the school. You'll need your child's birth certificate, certificate of immunization, two proofs of residence, a utility bill and a property tax statement, mortgage statement, lease agreement, something of the sort, a photo ID, and any custody documents that may be applicable in your family situation. Once both steps are completed, children will be entered into the random selection. Random selections will be held in March and they will all take place virtually. All families that are entered into the random selection will see, receive a link the day before. Some sites such as Central, Legacy, Monrovia, and Mount Carmel do charge tuition. Tuition typically ranges from $40 a month to $300 a month, and it's based on the number of people living in your home and the annual income of the home. Our first class pre-K programs located in Title I schools do not charge tuition because they receive federal funds that are used to supplement their pre-K program. In Madison County Schools, we do adhere to zoning requirements, so children must pre-register for the school that they are zoned to, to attend. Students zoned for Huntsville City Schools or Madison City Schools cannot attend Madison County Schools. If the school you're zoned to attend does not offer first class pre-K, you cannot pre-register at another school. However, you can still pre-register for any first class pre-K sites that are not located inside of a public school. Remember, children must be four by September 1st of the school year to be eligible for pre-K. Often we have children that turn four just after the cutoff, but unfortunately, due to our guidelines, we are not allowed to make exceptions to accommodate those situations. Children in first class pre-K attend five days a week from 745 to 245, just like our other elementary grades. We do follow the same school calendar for holidays and breaks. And if Madison County schools have to close or get out early for weather or something else, first class pre-K will be included in the elementary schools. Most of our schools provide after school care. If this is something that your family is interested in, please reach out to your school for more information about their programs. First class pre-K students are able to ride the bus to and from school. Your school will have more information about pickup and drop off time, drop off time as it gets closer to the start of school. Thank you for joining me for this informational video. If you have any questions that weren't covered in this segment, please reach out to me through the information listed on the screen. Have a wonderful day and I can't wait to see you all in the fall.